I was scrolling Twitter and Instagram and found everyone have lost their mind over this. Typing prompt in cursor or in cloud desktop and watch Blender creates the 3D scenes. This is my step by step guide to auto building in Blender with AI. It is stupidly easy and you don't need to be a tech genius. So let's start the good stuff. Here's what we need. First download Blender. It's free. Just Google Blender. Download it and get the latest version. Second, you will need Cursor AI. It's a cool coding tool. Find it at cursor.com. If you are not using Cursor AI, then you have to download Cloud Desktop. And finally, you have to install Python 3.0 or higher. Cool, now let's set it up. Open your browser and go to this GitHub link, Blender MCP. I will add all the links in the description. This is where we have to grab Blender MCP add-on. Connects Blender to Cloud or Cursor AI and find addon.py. This is the Python script. Click on addon.py and you can see the download button. Download it. Save it anywhere like in the desktop or downloads in your system. Now let's open Blender. Go to edit then preferences and click add-ons. Click this icon and locate your downloaded addon.py file and load it up. Once there, make sure this checkbox is enabled. Your Blender MCP add-on is installed. Now in Blender 3D view, press N to open the sidebar. You will see the Blender MCP tab with a hammer icon. Click start MCP server. It says the server's running on this port number 9876. Part 1 completed. Let's move on to cursor. Open cursor. It's where you will talk to Cloud. Go to the settings, then MCP. This is where we will set up the Blender MCP in Cursor. So the Cursor AI can talk with Blender. Click on this plus icon, add new global MCP server. MCP.json file will open. It's a blank file. Go to the GitHub link, scroll down and you can see brew install UV. If you are using Mac, then copy this or if you are using Windows, please follow these two steps. I am using Mac, so I will copy this and open terminal. Just paste it and press enter. All the files and dependencies are downloaded. Now let's go back to the GitHub page once again. Scroll down. You can see Cloud for desktop integration. Copy this. Though we are using cursor, but this works perfectly. Copy this and paste it in the mcp.json file and place Ctrl S or Command S to save it. You can restart the cursor AI. Once you have restarted cursor, Go to settings, MCP and you will see your blender is running. If you see a red dot before blender, then just refresh it or just disable and enable it again. It will work perfectly if you have followed all the previous steps. Okay, now it's time to test. Before prompting in cursor, make sure the blender application is running. Type this simple prompt, create three red cubes in blender and hit enter. It's working. AI is now controlling the blender and creating the scene. The three cubes appeared. Let's switch to shader mode. Yes, it's red. Perfect. Let's type make the red cubes with shiny metal texture and press enter. It's working. Now it's a shiny red cube. Now Claude is doing all the work for us. You can even get fancy. A blue light over the cubes. Check it out. It's there. This is real-time magic guys. Now let's build a full scene. In cursor type, create a Minecraft style grassland with grass blocks, a small hill and a tree. Hit enter. Claude is building it step by step. It have created the grassland, then the hill and it have also created the tree. It might tweak things as it goes like adjusting textures. If it's not perfect, just say make the tree taller or whatever change you want and you can keep going. Before I wrap up, there are some tips. Keep your prompt clean, like a yellow card will work better than a vague prompt. If it glitches, restart Blender and don't run multiple MCP servers at once. It confuses things. That's it and now you are a pro at auto building in Blender using Cloud and Cursor. Pretty weird, right? Comment down below what you want to build next. If you like this, please like and subscribe and hit the bell icon. I'll be back with a new video. Bye-bye.